Okay, another Celestian uh, autopsy here. I got this speaker in a trade, and the guy told me, "Yeah, it, it's a good speaker. It only needs uh, like the wire was unsoldered from there." And I was like, "What the hell? Why would somebody go, you know, play there and whatever?" So I, anyway, took it for next to nothing. Anyway, so here's the story. Um, you can only reverse engineer the story and figure what happened so what ha what happened here is that this speaker obviously started ru rubbing i don't know if you can see it right there so when this guy started hearing a bit of a rubbing in the speaker he said hey i'm gonna try to fix it so he started removing the dust cap didn't see anything wrong there Flipped it around and tried to play with the soldering here. And if you cl look very closely, that's what he did. He, uh, shit, I can't zoom this close, but the speaker reads nothing right now. And, uh, yeah, I can't zoom any closer than this. But right here, uh, the wire is broke there. So, anyway, with my multimeter, I, um, Went and touched right at the tip of the little wire there, and then I read the 14, 15 ohm that it's supposed to read. So, right there, um, the speaker, I'm just going to fix that little wire, it may put a little extension and go pick it up. I'm just going to recenter um, this coil with spacers and, uh, and re glue everything up, and it's going to work like new. So, uh, some people uh, didn't believe in my first video that speakers really got fixed and uh, and you can clearly see uh, that it did rub look at the inside here can you see um right there right there it rubbed but it didn't it doesn't look it doesn't have any sign of overheating so there's two ways whether it's been uh it rubs because it overheated and uh, the 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 the, 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 the circle went a little bit uh, out of shape from expanding with the heat or the basket was dropped and it warped a little bit uh, and because uh, it's tight you know that cone is pretty tight in that little crack there <laughs> so that's the story the speaker is going to work like new in a few minutes